tinsel coil. Okay, as you know, the uh, coil itself, the secondary of the coil, is wound with uh, number 30 uh, Kynar covered uh, wire wrap wire. So I've got a little piece of that same wire right here, and I've hooked it up as the uh, as the ground, and there's the top terminal of the tinsel coil. So uh, I know it's a little hard to see. It's number 30 wire, okay? But that's what the coil was wound with. 550 turns of this wire right here. Okay, now I'm going to trigger the coil. And I think you can see that uh, that wire can't take the heat. There you have it. That's the same wire, little number 30 Kynar, that uh, the entire coil is wound with. Like that. And here is the sophisticated way that I've attached that wire to the capacity pot thingy right there. It just comes off the coil. One thing you don't want to do is to terminate inside the coil form because then you'll have arcs that form inside the, coil, the form. So I've just brought the wire around and taped it using a piece of metal duct tape to the capacity bowl there. So that's uh, another effect of uh, voltage rise in a standing wave resonator, quarter wave resonator. Um, you get current and voltage peaking at the top of the resonator. But within the resonator itself, things are okay. The wire can handle it. And the, the coil doesn't even get warm in that state. But obviously, when all that current is concentrated into one, one uh, little bit of wire, it uh, 